Uh, Carmen was shaken up as he stepped back. A, a whistling right uppercut rocked him back on his heels, and he came back to plaster the golden boy uh, mercilessly, especially along the ropes here where we had some excellent close-ups that gave you a real flavor of this wonderful fight. Coming your way from Wrigley Field outdoors. Ready for go, card. away and uh, Aragon of course takes a, a terrific body beating when he lets Harmon, uh, Carmen get in close like this. He makes no uh, attempt to back away from those body shots. Right on the button. Sort of a light left hook popped his head back. on the left eye of Aragon. when he can muster the energy. the hottest fighter to come up since Ray Robinson. He is Len Matthews, an undefeated 19-year-old lightweight. He'll face 25-year-old veteran Tommy Tibbs in a 10-rounder at the Philadelphia Arena. Matthews had 13 pro fights, won them all, 12 by knockouts, started boxing at 12 in the PAL in the same gym where Sugar Hart and Gil Turner train. He was 118-pound PAL amateur. Tony Graziano was his manager. Tibbs is from Boston, a brilliant boxer, anxious to get work. He boxed anybody to get a payday, and as a result, he was overmatched earlier in his career. But as he has matured, he's developed into a fine fighter in the past two years. He's New England lightweight champion, 143, lost 46, knocked out 11. So next Friday from Philadelphia, Len Matthews versus Tommy Tibbs on your Gillette Cavalcade of Sports. And now for round seven of a 12-rounder, Carmen Basilio with a continuing body attack, slam-banging into the soft part of the body under the rib cage of Art Aragon in the light trunk. is uh, comparatively little mark. There's just a few little cuts around the eyes. Nothing very serious to interfere with his vision. Observe 
observers watching uh, Basilio can speculate on what chance he would have against Virgil Akins or Ray Robinson and which would be better for him to fight. Provided, of course, he wins this one. She apparently is winning easily. And anything can happen in a fight. Cuts, well-timed punch. has been so busy defending himself, in case you just tuned in, that he hasn't had much of a chance to mount an attack. One minute to the end of round seven. on the left cheekbone of Aragon. fight. It's his 16th loss, and he has won 81 fights. 
For Carmen Basilio, it was his 73rd fight. A 153 of them. He lost 13, and he scored now 26 knockouts. Carmen Basilio, unmarked, looked very strong, but took an awful lot of punches, uh, considering the uh, caliber of his opponent. Square on the button, so uh, a lot of risk servers will be wondering how he would make out against Virgil Akins in the 147-pound class or Sugar Ray in a repeat. Remember, fans, every Friday night is fight night on the Gillette Cavalcade of Sports. Who's gonna go?